Now that the devastating monster Yami Ghetto has been revived, the only way to seal him away again is with the power of the eight Omni Lords. It's up to us to find them, and there's only one way we can. We, we got, got a buddy fight! fight. <laughs> What's going on with him? I thought eating Tenbu was going to fully revive him. Hmm, maybe he had indigestion from eating too fast. Kisha! Tenbu's power was too much for him to process. He'll remain in his current state for a while. <laughs> a good time to pay him back for all he's done! <laughs> They're highly unstable, so don't get too close. Thanks for that timely information. You really aren't too bright, hey? <laughs> We'll always be buddies, Jack. And together we will grow stronger. Star Guardian Jack Knight. Cross Knight. Galaxy Burst. Now on sale. Bushy Road. <sighs> what do you mean, special leave? Your duties with the Buddy Police Youth Division are not required for the immediate future. That's what it means. But we have to go after Yami Ghetto! <clears throat> he absorbed the fifth Omni Dragon Lord because he's trying to fully revive, right? We need to find the other Omni Lords as soon as possible, and I want to help! Other officers have been assigned to the search team, and besides, we have ample time before Yami Ghetto makes another appearance. He has to recuperate. <gasps> The only thing you should be worrying about right now is figuring out how to turn Drum into a true Omni-Lord. Huh? And you yourself need to become a fighter who is worthy of being an Omni-Lord's buddy. You're dismissed. I wasn't prepared for this. What's required of an Omni-Lord's buddy? This is all just so crazy. I mean, me? An Omni-Lord? I, I don't know, know what, what I'm supposed to do! Huh? Hey. I hope we aren't interrupting. Teach asked me to drop off your homework, bro. Man, that's a lot! With you on special leave, the school figured it was a good time to catch up on things. Uh, yeah, great. Tell me, bro, how you doing? I mean, a lot of stuff's gone down. Yeah, with Buddy Police Headquarters being destroyed, how are they managing? Well, good as can be expected. They're making do working out of the satellite buddy car offices in Districts 2 and 3. And they're trying to find the remaining Omni Lords by following up on the leads coming into the Amano Suzu Group's hotline. And the Buddy Police Youth? Now that Tezuku's heading things up, they're ready to respond to reports all across the entire country. How can they manage that? Sounds impossible. <laughs> yeah, totally crazy, right? Thing is, our new headquarters is pretty mobile. Uh huh? The 
With the great Jasuku's recent appointment as the leader of the Buddy Youth Division, I wanted to lend my support by offering this as his temporary headquarters. But to be honest, I'm more than a little perturbed that the leader's never here. I mean, really! And on top of that, they've got Gao away on some imposed leave. You don't care Zanya's not here? You don't say. I hadn't really noticed. What do you think you're doing? That's Jasuku's chair! Get up at once! Whoa! Huh? With Tsuku out on assignment, I've come to share some promising news that may aid in our search for the Omni Lords. Why does Tsuku have to be out there? I mean, why not send this rookie here? You cut me deep just now. Huh? huh? Sorry, guys. I'm still a long way from being at full strength. I also came to thank you personally, Lady Suzuha. It's because of you that we obtained the helpful information on the Omni Lords. Oh, oh, well, you're most welcome, Count. You'll find once the remaining Omni Lords have been identified, all of our officers will be deeply grateful to you, my dear. That includes Tezuku and Gal, of course. Honest? Do you really mean it? Oh. How can I ever thank you, Suzuha? Please let me know how I can repay you. Case, I guess I can wait a little while longer. Now, I insist that you join me for tea while we wait for Tsuku to return. And please, feel free to sit in Gao's special chair if you wish. <laughs> ah! Metal Machine Ninja Showdown! Be a Kuya versus Suki Kage! Uh, that guy's gotta be an Omnilord! Check out the size of his horn! I don't think so. What do you mean? Of course he is. That is a rhinoceros. I know that's the form he's in now, but Omnilords could be posing as anything, right? And I looked it up. Rhinoceroses are supposed to have two horns. This guy only has one! So I think maybe the first Omni Beast Lord you're looking for has disguised himself as this big guy right here! Nin. Interesting theory, but that's an Indian rhinoceros. <gasps> Me? And they're identified as having only one horn. It says so right here. <gasps> hey, that's true. Sukiyage, yes! why are you acting so surprised? You should know him. You fought the first Omni Beast Lord once before. Me? It's imperative we find the first Omni Beast Lord, but we just aren't having any luck. Hey, Big Z, I think I found him. Really? That's not him! Over here! Are you for real? That must be him! Akatsuki! My brother's too overeager. He's taking us all over the place. It's getting so... I can't even find a single lead. I'm feeling lucky. Next time we'll find him for sure. Nin, nin. Uh, you've done enough! What? No, wait! I need to keep my eyes peeled for even the slightest clue. Huh? Wait up! Howdy, little dudes. Huh? Hey, how are you guys? Oh, a girl! Did you find the Omni Lords? You are still looking for them, right? Wait, what are you doing here? Don't tell me there's one hiding at Castle. I can't reveal the secrets of the operation. Well, if you have some time, how about we have a buddy fight? Uh, <clears throat> Sorry, I can't today. I'm here on official business. I came strictly to buy some cards. Oh. Don't mind him. That young chap's as ill-mannered as usual. Don't be a stranger. Wouldn't it be cool if you opened up a rare card? There's a reason they're called rare, little brother. No way! Commander I, I'm picking up a buddy monster signal. Really? Where? Just give me a second. This makeshift satellite is a little slow. There, at a shopping mall in Toshi Buya. Oh no, we lost the signal. Perhaps we could relocate to one of the district offices? Out of the question. As Commander, I can't abandon HQ for any reason! Uh, help me up. A white Suki Kage? It's about time you opened me up! Here I am, coming to you from the far reaches of Kulio Kachina World! Put your hands together for Zanya's buddy! Hmm? 
Lasagna's buddy? Min! But I already have one. Min! Stop it right there, old buddy, old pal. I can see the wheels of confusion burning rubber in your mind. You're thinking that this average guy in the black suit is good enough. Wrong! He's weak and unreliable. That's why I've come to save you from mediocrity. For a Nano Machine Ninja, I'm the absolute very best there is. Nano Machine Ninja? Min. Huh? Uh huh? Big Brother? You got it. I'm Nano Machine Ninja Biakuya. AKA Suki Kage's big brother. All right, Junior, now I'm here. You can scram, capiche? Mama needs you back in Cotton World to clean the garage. Yeah. Does he have to go? It seems a little sudden, don't you think? Let's try and keep emotions out of it, shall we? I get that it's a shock, really, I do. But let's face facts. You want the best buddy there is, right? Judge for yourself. If I'm not superior in every way, I'll be the one to leave. Agreed? Yeah. Huh? First up, the 100 meter dash. On your mark, get set. Faster! Higher! Yeet. Further. Convinced yet? Yeet. A true ninja must be quick at gathering and relaying information. So for our next event, we'll have a speed writing contest. Come on, Sukikage. He's got this one in the bag. I'm ten times faster than him. <gasps> And being ninjas, we just gotta have a ninja arts contest, but not just your run-of-the-mill kind. We are Nano Machine Ninjas, so prepare for the ultimate Nano Machine Ninja Arts Showdown! Nano Machine Ninja Arts, art of Nano Nano Need. Need! Where'd they go? Look down there. I only see Suki Kage. So where's Biakuya? The art of Nano Nano Need is devoted to making yourself smaller and creating numerous duplicates of yourself, too. <gasps> Looks like I win again! Nin. I trust this has enlightened you and helped you to see which of us is truly worthy of being Lord Zanya's buddy. Huh? Suki Kage, make your appropriate farewells with haste and then return to Cotton World immediately. We have to say goodbye to him? No fair! I don't wanna! A ninja's heart cannot be soft. Zanya deserves the very best for his buddy. No one must interfere. Yeah, but... We only became buddies with buddy monsters so we can have buddy fights. So, shouldn't we be testing which one of you is superior through a buddy fight? You make a valid point. Akatsuki, you take Suki Kage as your buddy. Zanya and I will fight against you. Then we'll see who is the best. But he's all I know. Don't worry, it's the only way. Whoever wins will become your buddy. We shuffle. This is all so weird, but I guess at the very least, it'll be interesting to see what kind of monster he is. I just got a text from Kazane. Huh? Get this. She says that Zanya and Akatsuki are going to have a buddy fight. Keeping it all in the family, hey, bro? We've all got to go and check this out. Yeah! Count me in! Wherever there's a buddy fight, you'll find me, Paruko Nanana. Today, we have a special treat, a Kisaragi showdown between brothers Zanya and Akatsuki. I gotta do this for Suki Kage. I won't lose no matter what. All right, Zanya, what do you say? Let's show that uppity little brother of mine what it's like playing with the grown-ups, shall we? Zanya has the first move. Hey, guys, over here. Good timing. It's just about to start. I call Yumi Ninja Suiha to the center area! I have trained for such a day. Suiha allows any player that calls him to search his deck for a size one or less ninja and add it to his hand. Hey, Bob, it's my job to explain that! Our water escape, flowing water chant. I add Electron Ninja Sheen to my hand and call him to the right! I use Cyber Analyze and draw two cards! <laughs> there is nothing my arrow of luminance cannot pierce! Ah! End of move. Huh? If he loses, he's no longer his buddy? That's what I heard. And Tsuki Kage will also have to go back to Cotton World. No way! I wouldn't be okay with that. Are you Zanya? I call Stealth Ninja Kiri Kakure Saizo to the left and Accelerate Ninja Hayate to the right. I buddy call Suki Kage to the center. Nin! The buddy gift lets him regain one life point. Go and attack that Suiha! Nin! I cast Demon Way Gepaku Kiri! 
That was a counter spell that unleashes an attack when one of your monsters is defeated! Hide in the mist and cut through the shadows! Mutation sword! Final phase! I set lethal formation! Set! Looks familiar. I guess his deck's a lot like his brother's. I call Hidden Sword Ninja Sekitetsu to the right, and Japanese Blade Ninja Hachimonji to the left! Villainy is fast to spread. I seek honest combat. I equip Water Slash Sword Murasame! I hope your heart is in this and you don't plan on tricking me. Guess you don't know me. Hidden Sword Style Wild Slashing Steel! Tsukikage! Japanese Sword Style Single Sword Vertical Division! When I draw my treasured blade, it shines like a jewel! Water Slash Sword for Asami! <laughs> End of move. That was fantastic, but you are aware that Murasame is destined to disappear at the end of the turn. For the last time, pal, that's my job! This is it. I draw. Charge and draw. There's no way I'm letting Tsukikage get sent back to Katana World. I call to the center! Nin. Akatsuki calls Tsukikage a second time! I call to the right. My secret weapon, Tsukikage Blade Master Mode! Nin. Is it me, or am I seeing double? Tsukikage Blade Master Mode boosts his critical whenever there's a Tsukikage card in the drop zone. If he converts his attacks, it'll be a major amount of damage. So he can just fire up some defensive spells. Unless Akatsuki set Secret Sword Star Crusher in the lethal formation. Okay, Big Z. All you gotta do is use a defensive spell. If you do, then I win. Gotcha! You've fallen into my trap, big brother! Lethal formation activate! Secret Sword Star Crusher! Your counter spell's been neutralized, and I inflict three damage to you! All the monsters in my field have a combined critical of seven. I've won. Ninjas unite and attack my brother! With stealth! Nin! Nin! Sonya's hit with a triple attack and receives Massive damage! End of move. How come you're not defending yourself, you dweeb face? Because your strategy is so transparent. Guess it was Star Crusher after all. So now he can't just use any spell he wants. I wonder what Zanya's gonna do. I return Murasame to the cards in my hand. What's he doing? He's taking Murasame out of the drop zone. I buddy call to the center. The wait is over. The star player has arrived. That's right, it's the amazing Nana Machine Ninja Byakuya in the flesh. My trusty taco scope will give us his deets. Nano Machine Ninja Byakuya. Attribute Ninja. A size one monster. With 5,000 power, 1,000 defense, a critical of one, and get this, he has two abilities. Tsukikage here is blocking my center, and I've got five life left, so no matter how much you try to attack, I can defend my life points and outlast you. Nin. Huh? Uh. Hidden sword style, wild flashing steel! Yeah. How did she get past Suki Kage? It's Shadow Dive. There are monsters from Kajina World that have Shadow Dive ability too? You think that's special? Give me a break. Everyone look closely. It's what I'm known for. Huh. He's attacking the fighter even with the monster in the center position. It's Shadow Dive! I cast Art of Body Replacement! Oh yeah, now I won. Think again, young Kisaragi. Come on, Zonya! Thanks, I know. I activate Biakuya's ability. I discard all the cards in my hand. When I'm in the field and all non-monster cards are discarded from Zonya's hand, I can attack as many times as I want. It's called the Nano Machine Clone Exterminate. That's amazing. This guy is one super powerful buddy, bro. Your life is now mine. And mine. And mine. Mine too. Game over. Winner, Danya Kizaragi. Suki, <laughs> Suki always was a little sensitive. I get that it's hard to say goodbye, but a promise is a promise. Now return to Cotton World on the double. Mean. The thing is, I never made any such promise. <laughs> huh? Hold the phone, muchacho! You can't renege now! We had a deal! We said whoever won the fight would become your buddy! Remember the ninja code! We are nothing without our honor! No, you said that without even consulting me. 
That's true. Z didn't agree to anything. Me? Uh, but he went along with the fight. Mm. Uh, even if you didn't agree right away, it's as clear as the nose on your face which of us is more worthy of being your buddy. Now, let's go start the process for switching me over as your buddy. What do you say, Ken? Well, it is true that you are an excellent monster. Yes, and? See, the thing is, you have one glaring flaw. Uh, that's absurd! What are you talking about? You talk way too much! Uh. Mm. Uh. You make me feel as uncomfortable as I do around girls! And do you know why that is? Because they're chatterboxes! Girls talk too much! They go on and on and on about nothing meaningful and they never listen to a single word you say! I know, I hate that! No. You don't listen either! You actually thought that Rhinoceros was the first Omni Beast Lord! Yeah, that wasn't my best moment. Those who talk too much are not suited for being my buddy! Meaning that I'll be more troubled if you become my buddy! But I'm the better, stronger ninja! Tsukikage is the only buddy for me. Now and forever, we share a bond. I knew at the moment we first met, we were fated. We chose each other and have been best friends ever since. Mm. Hooray! Now we can all be together! I'm so happy you can stay and won't have to leave us! Mm. But then why was my card opened? If you're interested, I'd really like it if you'd become part of my deck. To be honest, I could use your strength. Of course! I'd do anything to help you, Zanya! I'd climb mountains, swim oceans, walk through fire, fend off horses! Just try not to talk so much, okay? Uh huh? Nin. Cool! Now the two brothers get to fight side by side! Nin. From now on, I'll obey your orders, big brother, and do everything in my power to help us win. Big brother? I thought Tsukikage was your younger brother. I guess it can be confusing for you humans who are obsessed with chronological order, but in the world of nanomachine ninjas, the superior ninja is always referred to as the big brother, regardless of birth order. If you must know, I was actually born after Tsukikage, but by choosing him as your preferred buddy, I am automatically now the little brother. I don't really mind. In the end, it's best for brothers to get along. I couldn't agree more. I guess we should do the same. Yeah, we gotta work together and stop fighting. Come on, let's go find the first Omni Beast Lord, Zian. <laughs> <laughs> it turns out that the monster spotted in Chogunma isn't an Omni Lord after all, just a registered monster. It was mistakenly reported as possible because of its horns. We've gotta keep searching. Okay, report back to base. Why don't we take a little detour first? Let me guess, you want to check in on Gao? Yeah, Jack. He could probably use a friend. I'm worried about him after dropping his first fight. Welcome to Tsuku's Buddy Police 101. Today I'm going to teach you all about Nanomachine Ninja Biakuya. I'm all ears! He destroys his enemies with the skillful Nanomachine Clone Exterminate. Each time you discard a non-monster card from your hand, he can attack again. And he has Shadow Dive ability, which lets him blow past an opponent's center monster. That's awesome! He works well with Water Slash Sword Murasame, which can return from the drop zone to your hand. Wish I could return home to bed. <laughs> Shining stars call to us Here we are Standing strong Shining with our body lights No one made the choice for us We will choose our destiny Better than a miracle Reality Future stars Next time, 
Gao is taken by the Hundred Demons Hunter, and he's forced to compete in a buddy fight. I can't leave my buddy on his own, so I power up to lend a hand. Next episode, I'm the hero, Justice Trump. Join us for a buddy fight.